my most prized possession is this record. Uh, this woman is my mother. This woman, this woman's my father. <laughs> no, this is my mother. This is my father. This woman right here is really responsible for my musical ear. Her name is Karen Briscoe. She's an aunt. And this is a good friend of the family, Richard Booker. Uh, the name of the group was Congress Alley. And uh, although my father had an oldies doo-wop life before 1973, this is pretty much the only record they released. How many albums do you have in here? Um, in total, I think I'm up to about 35,000 records, of which I think represented in here now is somewhere like maybe 28 up to there. I, I have about 10,000 uh, other records in storage. How do you have it divided? Um, I, I could be fluid with that. This is how I have it categorized because to do it in alphabetical order would be an utter nightmare. Um, my soul row is the middle row, something I could reach for. So pretty much my 60s soul here, my 70s soul spreads all the way around here. My 80s soul LPs all around here, 90s. Not many records I acquired in the 90s, but soul records right here. Two, 2000 and above is in this area. Neo soul in this area pretty much right there and any compilation records I have. My um my my favorite part is uh pretty much any any of these records over here where you have uh special plastic covering is uh mainly albums that I'm I'm a collector of uh hip hop samples. If if people have done notable hip hop sampling then uh I, I pretty much collect them like uh like baseball cards, you know. If someone used a real hot sample then uh, I'll go for it. Like uh, Commons the Light was used by this uh, this record right here. I know I'm like giving away magic tricks and some producers will kill me. Um, Biggie's uh, Ten Crack Commandments right here. Actually, Biggie's uh, Hypnotize is outside of the case. Uh, my librarian will hear about that. Um, Yo Mama by The Far Side. You know, uh, this is a favorite one. This is The Choice Is Yours by Black Sheep. That very obscure bass line. Doo, 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 doo. Very hard to find in the midst of all that, all that sampling, um, all that bass solos. So pretty much all my obscure hip hop samples are on this row. All my jazz records are on this row. Um, all my hip hop 12 inches are divided by years, starting with uh, 1979 going all the way down to uh, 2002. My sister organizes. Uh, she's my librarian. Uh, how long did it take you to build the studio? Um, it took about, about three months, I, I guess three months to conceptualize. You know, I have secret spots in New Mexico. I got secret spots in Portland. I got secret spots in LA, San Francisco. Dallas, I go online a lot, you know, people trade me records, I go to Atlanta, and um, pretty much cats know of my, my love for, for collecting um, records.